Hello and welcome back to our Kansas Jayhawks Dynasty in NCAA Football 2011 on the PS2. We are in Season 2 right now. We're going to be playing Games 3 and 4 today. I got home a little bit later than I planned on it, so we're only going to do two games, but that's fine. We will finish Season 2 this week. Uh, we'll probably play a few games tomorrow. And a bunch on Friday. Saturday I will not be home, but Sunday I will also be streaming. Let me get this here image off the screen. There we go. Hopefully everybody's doing all right today. Hammer Jammer in the chat. Michael Gregory. Tyler Rocky. What's going on, everybody? Don't forget to slap the like button, guys. Subscribe if you're new. And join the Discord community. There is a link in the description below. All sorts of good stuff happening there. All right, let's do a quick recap. See our schedule. We beat Buffalo at home, 55-31 to start off the season. Then we traveled to TCU and beat them, 31-14. Uh, we pretty much dominated them. I mean, they had some nice plays, a couple of good drives, but for the most part, uh, we held their offense in check. And we are on a five-game winning streak right now. And currently, ranked 20th in the nation. You love to see it. You just love it, all right? You really do. All right, what do we got going on? Let's go to recruiting. Make sure we do this. I don't want to forget that and lose out on all of these really good players here. All right, let's see. We're number one on the wide receivers list. That'll be huge. He's 6'4", 190 pounds. I mean, that's, that's a pretty decent-sized receiver. His hands are only a D+, plus, but you know what? We don't really uh, throw the ball a whole lot, so as long as he can come down with about uh, half of the passes thrown his way, I'll be all right with it. We are currently in second for the tackle from Abbotsford, Canada. He is the number one prospect in preseason recruiting. He was a 4 9 40? What? An offensive lineman. Okay, awesome. We are number one for Carl James, free safety out of Big Spring, Texas. Number one for John Hall. That's a guard. We desperately need offensive line. Uh, A-plus field awareness. That is beautiful. And a 30.9-inch vertical for a man that weighs 321 pounds. That is very impressive. We're number one for Jason Jackson, outside linebacker. And number one for David Ross, another outside linebacker. We're trying to beef up the back seven of the defense. Uh, excellent discipline for this young man. So I like that. A-plus field awareness. Hands, F, that's fine. We're going to send him on a lot of blitzes. Let's see what else we got going on here. I think that's it for players. Nope, we got one more here. Uh, Terrence Foster, three-star tight end. He's actually the number one tight end in the country from Antioch, California. Hopefully I said that right. Uh, we are number one for him over USC, Boise State, Utah, and Cal. He runs a 4-5-40. That is extremely good for a tight end, especially one that's 6'6", six six, 248 pounds. He'll be a big target in the red zone. He's got A-plus hands. I love it. So hopefully we can get that guy. Uh, hopefully we can get all these guys. That would be ideal. But we are going to just jump right into the games. I'm ready. We're going to be taking on Georgia Tech. It's in Lawrence, Kansas. This is a rematch from last season where, I mean, they kind of just, they, they just beat us. I mean, that's really all there is to it. We got dominated in that game. I think we had negative 55 rushing yards. So we are going to look to run the football quite a bit here today, of course, because we run the option. That's what we do here in Kansas. Look at that. Alabama beating Arkansas. Okay. Uh-oh. We got players that have committed infractions. I don't like that. I don't like it at all. Augustino. Let's see. These guys are not starters. Both defensive tackles. They clearly did this together. Missed a class recently. Okay. What did he do? Unprepared. Yep. Yeah, these guys are... Uh, yeah. Not liking that. So we're going to give you two games. And we're also going to give you two games. He's a red shirt anyway. I mean, these guys don't play. So... Four career tackles for John Williams. None for Augustino. They will not be missed this game. That is totally fine. I'm okay with it. we got to keep that team interest down. Now let's go stomp a mud hole in Georgia Tech's behind. Let's get it. Offensive playbook. 
What did we pick? Do we have the right one on there? Profile one. Yeah, sure. All right, let's get it. Marvin Joseph in the chat. What up, brother? Internet bill paid. Yes, sir. Decline time all week, except for Saturday. But it's all right. I'll be streaming on Sunday. All right, let's see. We are 2-0. Oh. They are also 2-0. and 2-0 oh. oh in conference play this early in the year. That's kind of bizarre, but I'm here for it. I like it. Man, they are number 12. So this is going to be a, a tough game for us, I think. As long as we can run the ball, we should be all right, though. Let's go, Herbie! Get it, boys. Their quarterback's having a pretty good season for them. Not sure what's going on with their rushing attack, but we shall see soon enough. Let's get it. You know what? I want the ball first. I'm feeling it right now. Let's go. Here we go. I gotta turn the commentators off. This one's gonna be down in the end zone for a touchback. All right, Brad. I'm sorry. You're a great commentator. Kirk Herbstreit as well. Lee Corso. I love y'all. But you gotta go. All right, let's get it. Let's do this. Power T to start off. Let's go lead option. Let's get it. That's right, Tyler. We are 20th, man. Moving up in the world. We are 12 and 4. Actually, well, we're 11 and 4 technically. Since they count the, uh, what you call it, spring game. Oh, boy. Well, that's not a good start. That is exactly what Georgia Tech did to us uh, last season. And it wasn't pretty. Let's try power option right. Out of the wishbone. Let's go get some good blocks on the right side. I got zero blocking on the right. We are looking to throw it on third and 17. This is exactly what the Yellow Jackets did to us last season. So hopefully we can uh, we can figure that out. Like real quick right now would be great. All right, we got post corner combo on the left side. Uh, we got single coverage on the right. Safety is playing close to the line. This could be good for circle. And I got no blocking. Awesome. So that's a great drive, guys. Uh, really hot start. Momentum completely in our favor, of course. Also, if you guys haven't checked it out yet, we have the Hammer Climb podcast up on Spotify. It'll be on YouTube here soon as well on this channel. Uh, go ahead and check it out. Me and my best bud, Hammer. Talking about top 10 quarterbacks going into this season for the NFL. And I'll force that fumble. Let's go. Let's go. Smiley. Great, uh, really great takeaway there. But anyways, we're talking about the top 10 quarterbacks, in our opinion, going into this NFL season. Also, we do predictions for the AFC East. And, you know, we just, we just BS a little bit. You know, that's just what we do. A little rant here. A little rant there. Throw it up top. Get that. You're just better, Smiley. You got the fumble recovery on the punt. 
And a big catch down inside the 10 yard line. Let's go. Beautiful corner route by the sophomore tight end, Trent Smiley. Also, uh, idea for the next series on the channel after this one, guys. I don't know if you are interested in uh, Campus Legend. Anything like that, I could do something like that. It would not be for any of the games before 09, though. we got to have the Super Sim in there. But we'll figure it out. Oh, no! Oh, come on, pick! You let me down, son. You let me down. That was a terrible pitch. Threw it right at the back of somebody there. That's that's unfortunate. All right. Well, let's go defense. Usering Davis on the left side corner spot. And they're going to hand it off up the middle to Jefferson. He'll get a few yards. All right, let's see. I want to keep outside linebackers on blitzes. Get the crowd going crazy. Over 100 decibels. Let's go. 103. Where are you going? Oh, how did I get blocked there? And then I got clipped. My word. Mungo in the chat. What up, Mungo? You the best. Yeah, I was messing around with uh, all the other college games throughout the week without my internet. Coming up with other series ideas and whatnot, so. I would definitely be down for a Campus Legend, Road to Glory, whatever you call it any, anymore, uh, series. And then move them on into Madden as well for uh, Superstar Mode. Do a full career. That could be a lot of fun. Yeah, I know, Marvin. This, this is going to be rough, buddy. We we should have scored on our first drive there. Uh, especially after, you know, the forced fumble on the punt. And then the big play to the tight end. But, you know, we just we just find a way to, to give the ball away. Unfortunately. And I think that was actually our first missed opportunity in the red zone in this entire series. So, it, it took quite a bit. Alright, let's go 3-4 over Fire Green. That's alright, as long as we keep this crowd up over 100 decibels, we'll be alright. 108, I saw it. I know you did too. 105, let's go. Nice tackle. Campus Legend Superstar Mode Series would be awesome. Yes, sir. I think that's what we might do next. Take a little break from uh, Dynasties. I know a lot of people want the FCS series to come back in the EFL, which they will. They will. Don't you guys worry. But right now, I'm just having um, having a lot of fun with these series, to be honest. That is ours. Let's No shot he recovered that. Are you kidding me? Come on, man. Now, if that was my team, they would have scooped it up, scored a touchdown, 100%. Let's go, crowd. Get crazy. Get crazy. And I got a bad animation there. And that's a first down for Georgia Tech. What was the name of the podcast again? It's the Hammer Klein Podcast. One word. Capital H on Hammer. Capital C on Klein. It is posted in the Discord. If you are in there. You can go ahead and... Take a little gander. That's ours. Let's go. I was about to say, if I don't recover that, me and this TV right in front of me are going to have words. All right, here we go. This is going to be a good game. I like it. I really want to uh, run the football, though, so let's try to figure that out, shall we? Power sweep. Could be nice. Could be nice. Yeah, the, uh, the podcast is posted in the Discord in the Hammercline Klein podcast uh, channel section. Oh, here we go. Let's go. Okay, nice stiff arm. Only got a yard out of that. This is going to be tough sledding trying to get this ground attack working, boys. 
We might be able to expose them on some corner routes, though, like we did at the tight end. So let's see if we can get uh, Bashir's open left side. Nope. We got Smiley open. No way that was picked. All right, we're just going to keep turning it over. They're going to keep turning it over. Uh, it's going to be just a big old slop fest here in Lawrence, Kansas. Let's do it. I'm ready for it. It bounced off the back of my guy's helmet because he got absolutely depleted by the safety. Bruh. Nice tackle. Let's go. Don't worry, boys. We're going to figure it out. It's going to be nice, uh, fat zero to zero. Stand the first quarter. Guarantee it. Come on, baby. Let's go. Crowd going crazy. 109 decibels. I saw it. I think that's a new record, right? 109? What clock are you guys wasting right now? Dang. I appreciate you, Michael. You the best, man. You the best. Yeah, we plan on having at least one podcast come out a week. Uh, we're, usually we'll record them on a Tuesday night. Uh, Hammer will upload it on Wednesday or Thursday. Sometimes it might do too. Who knows? We'll see what happens. Just depends on the big news. Around the league. Oh, nice run. Oh, my goodness. I got depleted in the secondary. Bruh. Also, I was when I was playing NCAA 09, uh, let's see, Saturday night, I saw Iowa State win against, I, I can't remember. It was one of the FCS schools. I can't remember exactly which one it was. They beat them 107-0. I just thought you guys should know that. Holden Tharp injured on the play. That is a big blow to the linebacking core here for Kansas. That is not good news. Hopefully he's all right. Uh, but that's going to end the first quarter 0-0. Zero to zero. Uh, Two turnovers for each team so far. Uh, we got a fumble for Kansas and a pick. And two fumbles for the Yellow Jackets. Sweep. Don't you let him get to the outside. There we go. Good tackle. Let's go. 3-4 solid. And middle linebacker cross blitz. And hold on Tharp. Luckily just out for the game. He's not going to miss extended time with the injury. Come on, GT. What you going to do, baby? Sweep. He broke that. Oh, my goodness. What a great run. All right. Third down and three. This is a big play. Come on, crowd. Back us up. Let's go. Ain't no way you guys hear that play, right? No way. Counter. Let's go. Good stop. We hold him to a field goal. Now let's block it. Let's go. I wish you could pump the crowd up on field goals. I don't know why you can't. I mean, in real life, the crowds go insane. And we don't block that. Wow, the kicker, not a very strong leg, but they do get the three. And they're up top now in the second. Three a zip. All right, let's figure it out on offense here. Let's hold on to the football. And try to get our run game working a little. Because so far, it has been uh, non-existent. Best play of the game so far for us has been the catch by the tight end, Smiley. I just got crushed. Yeah, we have negative 11 rushing yards. That is about to change right now, guys. Go wishbone normal power option. We're going to figure it out. Let's go. 
if the right side of the line can actually block. Nope, they don't block. And Lewis just died. Dang it. Yep. I, I, would, I would flex too after that hit. That was disgusting. Alright, what are we doing here, guys? Alright, let's switch it up. Okay, oh my goodness. If the right tackle holds that block for just a split second longer, uh, Tyler Hunt can still be running down the sideline. You know, I don't like it being third and long all the time. That's just not fun for me. This is unacceptable. Alright, here we go. They're down to nine. He's open! And he held, oh my goodness, he actually held on to it. Let's go, Jenkins. I thought he was going to drop it. A really good catch for the slot receiver. All right, let's try, uh, let's see. Let's try a screen to the right. You know, if, if they just hold that block, for more than uh, point zero zero one seconds, that could actually be a really good play. All right, where? There we go. Speed option. All right, let's get a man in motion. Man. We're just getting hit right at the line of scrimmage every play. That was also a late hit on my quarterback. Goodness gracious. Alright, third down and 12. It's been a, a bit rough so far. He's open. There you go. Let's go, McGriff. True freshman with the first down. I love it when a plan comes together. All right. Rushing attack. Can we do it? Also, the pick earlier was picks. First interception on the year. Oh my. This front seven is just so talented. Trying to figure it out. Let's go. Let's try a triple option. So you got the two star linebackers, which makes it really tough. Run, Tyler! And we get the first down. Okay. That's a start. That is a start. I'll take that. Ball on the 16-yard line. And that was, in fact, our first ever miss in the red zone last time in here. Unacceptable. And, of course, I get sacked. Awesome. It's never good when your offensive lineman is facing the quarterback. I had the tight end open on a corner route as well in the end zone. Alright, let's try it again. Different play. Trying to get this option working. Oh, I just died. They just know exactly what we're going to run. Like, every time. Not a whole lot I can do about it. Alright, third down and 20. We are in field goal range. It'd be a 43 yarder from here, so hopefully we don't get sacked. Oh my goodness. Alright. 
Well, at least we got rid of it. And they want us to go for it. No. What was wrong with you, coach? We want the points. Give us all the points. Francis. On for the kick. The kick is up. And... Oh, it's off the upright. The freshman misses it. And we are still down 3 nothing with just over a minute left in the first half. That is now two missed opportunities in the red zone in this game alone. Dang. Did not see this game being such a defensive slugfest here. There's no points. How do we not get the sack there? Really good play by the quarterback to evade the defender. I'm waiting for that decibel meter to hit 110. That would be amazing. Where's he going with this? Nowhere. All right, the pressure is working on the quarterback, so I'm liking that. Let's go spy three. Get a quarterback spy, blitz the outside linebacker on the right. I get the deep third on the left. The crowd's going wild. And they're just going to run it, and we get to stop. All right. Timeout. And I'm going to coach up our offensive line right now. Because right now, it's just, uh, it's just not it. It's not happening. Maybe we can get a nice punt return here. Should have decent field position, I think. Let's go, Sims. Don't you fumble my football. Made one guy miss. Too bad there was four more waiting in the wings. All right. If I can get some blocking on this play action, I'm going to take a shot to Bashir's on the right. I did not get blocking. I'm going to take off left. And that guy is extremely fast. Man alive. Let's go shotgun. This is tough, boys. This is a tough one. Send McDougal deep left. One on one. Get that McDougal. Oh my goodness. Just need a big play. Just one. One that we actually capitalize on. So we had the big pass to Smiley in the first quarter, and we really haven't done too much else on offense since then. All right, we're going to get the corner right here. Harad Jr. Throw it up. He's got it. Let's go. Big play. We got one timeout left now. Let's get on the board. Coach up the receiving core. I'm going to do double corner routes. What's he doing? Let's see. I'm going to go right up the seam to hunt, maybe. He's wide open. And let's go. I underthrew that because I got absolutely destroyed. But hey, it worked. Come on. Come on, O line. We only got one timeout left. Oh, man. Wasted way too much time getting to the line. All right. We're going to throw it to the end zone. He's got the arm for this. We're only at the 31. Uh, I'm not going to try another field goal because we missed the 43 yarder. Let's go up the seam to McGriff, maybe. Let's see what we got going on there. Circle's open. Let's go, Bashirs! I did it myself! The user touchdown reception! And we finally get on the board and take the lead as time expires with the 31-yard Hail Mary. Yeah, if we're playing 06 right now, Marvin... Calvin Johnson would just be destroying my secondary. 
Man, that touchdown felt so good. Pretty sloppy start, but somehow we're going into the half, into the locker rooms with the lead. And it's perfect because we have to kick it off to them to start the third quarter, so uh, it's very nice that we just scored to end the half. There it is, 7-3. We are on top. Having some success on the last drive. I like that we're actually able to throw the football a bit now. I, I figured out how to do it. Just don't ever throw a bullet pass, guys. Not in this game. Except for on uh, wide receiver screens, maybe. But even then, I mean, we see it's not working here. Oh, my goodness. Did you guys see the block on me and the stiff arm? Jeez Louise. All right, defense. Back to it. Spy gold. Counter. Oh, what a tackle by Davis. Let's go. That was pretty. We might just have to win this game throwing the football, which is <laughs> which is really weird to even say uh, with how successful we've, uh, we've been on offense on the ground since the latter half of season number one. Nice tackle. That was beautiful. No pitch. Didn't give him an opportunity for it. They're down in six now. Blitz the outside linebackers. I got Smith in the slot. Play action. And we get the sack. Let's go. Meston with the sack. His third tackle of the game as well. And we are cooking, boys. Running back almost got there for the block. Just not... Quick enough. Capers on for his second punt of the ball game. All right, Sims. We're going right. All right, Sims. Run, buddy. Sims down the right sideline. Oh, he bounces off the ref. Touchdown, Jayhawks. Oh, my goodness. I can't believe he just bounced off the ref. I thought that was going to force me into a tackle. Goodness gracious. Well, we extend the lead. Got a two-score ball game now, fellas. Starting to find our groove a little. Francis boots the extra point up and through. And it's 14-3. Did you avoid the Mizzou game? I'm not sure. Are they the fourth game of the year? I can't remember. But hello, Brendan. Hello. How are you? How are things? Come on, Edwards. Let's get it. I just dove the opposite way. That was embarrassing. All right. Let's get back to stopping this rushing attack. We have pretty much all the momentum right now, which is very nice. I got to cover the tight end on the left. Get him, boys. Nice tackle. And that was Lavelle Luke, the 90-plus overall freshman linebacker, making a nice play. Loss of two. Let's go, boys. Do it again. Play action. Oh, nice deflection. I trusted the computer there, and he did not let me down. I like that. Third and 12 coming up now. Oh, he's going to take off. Oh, man. He's so fast. I didn't do a quarterback spy. Instead, I just blitzed the linebackers. And that was, uh, yeah, not a good, not a good choice. 
Big third down pickup for the Yellow Jackets. Not a whole lot of offense in this game. Nice tackle. Do a double quarterback spy. Second down and eight. 109 decibels in the stands again. 109 again. Come on, give me 110. I'm not sure why they're running the clock down, to be honest. Let's go. Oh my goodness. This time he uses brute force. Just carrying a defensive. Was that a defensive end? My word. And again, we still have negative rushing yards against a very tough front seven for Georgia Tech. I mean, of course, these guys defend the option every day in practice, too, so it's not too much of a surprise that they're having success stopping us. But we, on the other hand, are having some decent success as well through the air, so it kind of evens out a little bit. It helps we have a punt return touchdown as well. Banshee Sue in the chat. What up, Banshee? Come on, defense. Let's go. Oh, nice tackle. Let's go, safety. All right. Third down and eight. Let's go double middle linebacker spy. Man coverage for everybody else except for the free safety. Play action. Get him. And he dropped it. Oh my goodness. I actually outran the receiver on that route. That was a good throw. He just dropped it. Alright, so good stop. And we will take another punt, please. Let's try a block. I want to see a blocked punt. We blocked extra points. I, don't, I can't remember if we blocked a field goal or not. I don't think we have. We nearly blocked that. Oh my goodness. We hit the kicker. Oh, that's first down. Well, that's unfortunate. Definitely did not need that. Our defense worked so hard to get the stop, too. Oh, that is just... That's heartbreaking. Let's go, defense. Keep it going, boys. That was a good tackle. Every time Jefferson has the football, I mean, he, he falls forward. He always falls forward for solid yards. differences between 06 and 11 uh, I mean the game on the field I mean it's it just feels so obviously different for me anyways of course all the games really feel different to me each one of them has their own unique things about them hey we got up to 110 decibels boys Let's go, and we got to stop. It's because of the stadium pulse, baby. Let's go. Pretty sure that's a new high for the stadium, 110 decibels. They're gonna go for it, yes they are. All right, let's go uh, three, four normal. Spy two man. Come on crowd, go crazy again. Can I get a 112? 115er. Get him. Aw, oh, good run. Dang it. They're just so hard to stop. Let's go fire green. Also, if you guys have not subscribed to the second YouTube channel, Optimus Klein 2, uh, it's one of the featured channels if you click on this channel. 
basically on that channel it's just gonna post all of these games uh, just individually so if you guys don't want to sit and watch a four-hour live stream back or you know eight hour or ten hours whatever I end up doing per stream uh, you can just go watch the individual games on that channel also subscribe to hammer jammer jr. for some hockey content and some football simulator. Oh, this is going to be a touchdown on what a run for Georgia Tech as they close the gap. Yes, the circle does improve throughout the game if they're doing good or bad, yes. Basically, like in 06, you have your impact players. Like in this game, like you have star players, but anybody can be an impact player, technically, if you know what I'm saying. Nearly blocked the extra point, and it's 14 to 10, with just under 30 seconds left in the third quarter. That was just a crazy back-breaking drive from that offense. 15 plays over 70 yards. Let's go, Sims. See, Sims is not a star player, but he has a punt return touchdown in the game, so that makes him an impact player right now because he is playing so well. All right, let's let's go offense. Let's get something going here on the ground, perhaps. And mild concussion out four weeks. Are you kidding me? That is insane. All right, let's get it. And we can't. The front seven is just too good. Way too good. We're going to have to win this game throwing the ball, I think, guys. Let's see. I'm going to let the clock run out. That's going to be it for the third quarter. We are on top 14 to 10 as we head into the fourth. Get your fours up in the chat. Can we take down the 12th ranked Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets in a rematch from last season's contest? Stick around and find out. All right, second down to 12. Oh my, I had three blockers, just didn't even hit anybody. Negative 18 rushing yards, guys. How insane is that stat? Like, you've seen what we've been doing lately on the ground. Georgia Tech is just that good. All right, Tyler, take it easy, buddy. Third and 19, fellas. Throw it up top. Oh my goodness, that was a perfect throw. But it was dropped. And we're going to have to punt it away. And our already tired defense will have to take the field after that long 15 play touchdown drive. Last time out for the Yellow Jacket offense. That is so unfortunate. Really good throw there from Kale Pick. Just no help from the receiver. Oh, man. There we go. Good team tackle there, boys. Let's go. We need you, crowd. Now more than ever. Oh, my goodness. This guy is so good. Look at him. Broke two tackles. Now he's carrying me for a few yards. Good grief. It's all right. Only three yards for uh, three broken tackles. I mean, I guess I'll take that. All right, second down and seven. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Good stop. Man, Tyler Hunt has only carried the ball four times in this game. Not a lot of opportunities for him, to be honest. Let's go, boys. No way. Okay. I got absolutely crushed again in the secondary. Good stop. 
by the defense, though. Fourth and seven coming up. They are going to punt it away. Crate in the chat. What up, Crate? How you doing, brother? All right, Sims, let's get it. Ah, no block. Spin. Ah, oh, dang it. Sorry, right, we broke one tackle. All right, we need the ground game to work. Just for one drive, that's all we need. I'm begging, please somebody block for me. Run! Oh man. I mean, even even the secondary uh, is tackling extremely well. You know, we got br a big bruising halfback in Tyler Hunt, and he just he cannot escape these guys. Just playing some NCAA football 06. Nice, I like it. All right, second out of 13. I pitched that way too early. I thought that linebacker was going to hit pick. Man, that free safety is killing us. Eight tackles, two sacks, and four tackles for a loss. Oh, my goodness gracious. That is insane. All right, slot post, third and 15. We're in a tough spot, fellas. I'm going to get my man uh, Harad Jr. in motion. Maybe hit him on the corner route. He's open. Let's go. Run. Let's go. Inside. Well, up past the 45-yard line. We are crushing it on the right side in the passing attack. All right. Now let's try to run the ball again. Please. Please. Help me. Let's try a lead toss. Maybe that'll work. Pick's having a good game. 196 yards passing. Uh, nine completions. That's not bad at all. Oh, man. This guy's just unblocked. These guys are just insane. Insanely good. All right, let's go inside smash, I guess. Is it bad to say that you're really enjoying playing retro NCAA games rather than 14? No, that's not bad at all. Retro games are the best games. All right, let's give this to Hunt up the middle, maybe. Oh, man. This, this guy is insane. All these safeties, the linebackers. I mean, really the whole defense. I just can't do anything on the ground. But here we are with a four-point lead with two minutes left in the game, guys. We can still pull this off. Just got to hang on. He's open. Oh, first really bad throw of the game. And we're going to have to punt it away. Less than two minutes left on the clock. Both teams still have all three timeouts. Just boot it as far as you can. There you go. Good tackle by Meston. All right, we need the defense to keep on keeping on. You know what I'm saying. All right. Come on, crowd. We need you. That's right. You can't hear nothing. Let's go. Great play. See, they're holding our offense in check, but we're also holding their offense in check. And that was Johnson, fifth tackle of the game, first sack. Whoops. Oh, man, I'm on the safety. I don't want to be on the safety. I'm scared. I'm scared. Have I tried playing the updated version of 06? I have not. Come on, defense. Ice, let's go. Another sack on the quarterback as he tried to take off, and it's Johnson again, his second. On the drive. Man, that receiver is just... Wow. He looks tired. 
Let's go. Third down and 11. Just continuing to get pressure on the quarterback. I don't want to get too crazy, though, with the, with the blitzes. Just got to make sure we have help in the secondary as well. Crowd, it's third and 11. Why are you not in the hundreds right now? Nice stiff arm, but we do get the stop. Fourth down and 10. Coming up. Let's go. Uh, we're going to coach up the secondary. Go 3-4 normal. Spy two man. Safeties are covering the halves. Come on, crowd. Help us out. This is for the game. Oh, he got the first down. Dang it. All right, they call a timeout. I believe they have... What do they have? One left? Yes, sir. One left. Keep coaching up the secondary. Man, neither team has 200 yards of offense in this game. Insane performances from the defenses. Get him! Alright. 45 seconds left in the game. They only have one timeout. Keep holding strong, defense. Let's go! Get that weak sauce out of here. Get out my face! Alright. I'm gonna go back to Spy 2 Man. Floyd Mitchell, what's going on, brother? Third down and one. And they're going to throw it. Get out of here. Let's go. Fourth down and one. Davis. Two straight deflected passes. All right. We're going to blitz. Middle cross. Let's go. But I'm actually going to have Luke do a spy. This could work. For the game. Fourth and one. They're running it. Let's go. Get him. Let's go. That's game, fellas. Defensive battle. And we come out on top. I don't care about the unsportsmanlike conduct. Celebrate all day. This is a huge win for the program. As we are going to take out the 12th ranked Georgia Tech Yellow Jackets here in Lawrence, Kansas. Heck of a game. Offenses, I mean, they, they were struggling all game long. But hats off to both defenses for coming out and and just being amazing, basically. All we got to do is down it one more time. They are out of timeouts, and that will do it. And we'll get into our second game. I can't remember who we're going to play. Might be Missouri. Not 100% sure. There we go. Kale Pick downs it. And that is going to be it. 14-10 to 10 is the final. Really good game. I mean, not a lot of fireworks. We did have a lot of success throwing the football, especially on the right side of the field, though. Uh, which was pretty surprising. But again, Georgia Tech just destroys, just absolutely negates our entire rushing attack. But in the end, it did not matter. 14-10, let's go. We should move up into at least close to the top 15 with this win today. Jared Green in the chat. What up, Jared? Game is a gem with good sliders. Absolutely. It is, it's a lot of fun right now. I'm enjoying it. And it's really cool, too, because we're going to have a dynasty in every single NCAA game on the PS2, except for 02, because that one, that's a little wonky. Um, it, it doesn't have as many 
you know, it doesn't have as many redeeming qualities as 03 and all the other games have, so I don't think we'll venture into a dynasty uh, on that game. But between 03 and 11, we're going to have dynasties, so I will have perfect sliders for myself for each one of those games. Um, so the next time we do a dynasty in each one of the games, you know, I won't have to sit there and, and spend half of the first season or the whole first season of the dynasty uh, trying to adjust to the actual gameplay itself. Uh, we had negative 30 rushing yards in this game. We actually improved from our contest with them last season where we had negative 55. Um, but yeah, I don't really care because uh, we got the dub this time. So that's that's really all I care about. We sacked them three times. We got sacked three times as well. Uh, Kale Pick did really good throwing the ball. 9 of 14. He threw his first pick of the year. Um, 196 yards passing. Uh, pretty good. And a touchdown. We had two turnovers. Uh, we missed a field goal. Uh, we left we left points in the red zone twice, unfortunately. But you know what? Again, we won. So that's really the only stat I care about. Look at this. I mean, we, we could do nothing. They were hitting us in the backfield nearly every play. Uh, Ricky Harad Jr., two catches, 63 yards. Bashir's had the touchdown. I don't know why it says 29 yards because, oh, okay, he had the screen that lost two yards. Okay, that makes sense. Smiley had the 37-yarder in the game. One drop for Harad, and that was on third and long, which he should have had it, but it's all right. Tackles, Lavelle Luke, the 90-plus overall freshman middle linebacker with seven tackles, and Steve Meston had seven as well. Uh, Steven Johnson had six, as well as me at corner, Anthony Davis. Tackles for loss. Let's see, we got eight. 10, 11, 11 tackles for loss as a defense, 4 for Steven Johnson. He went crazy. Uh, Meston and Lubbock Smith, the free safety, both had 2. Sacks, 2 for Johnson, 1 for Meston. No picks. Uh, deflections, 2 for Davis, 2 for McDonald, uh, who is out for 4 weeks. Well, technically 3 more games uh, with a mild concussion. 4 fumbles, both of those guys had 1 each. McDonald and Smiley had recoveries. Smiley had his on... The first punt of the game for us. And Brad Francis missed a field goal. 43-yarder. Punting. Not crazy. Uh, we had a punt return touchdown. 64-yarder for James Sims, the retro freshman halfback. All right. That was the number one greatest game, according to EA. So, what a great game. Absolutely, Floyd. That was a lot of fun. I mean, our offense wasn't fun, but the defense won us that game and it was great all right we have yes we do get to play missouri next they are 3-0 on the season let's go and what's their ranking top 25 as well love to see that do 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 oklahoma just lost to florida state usc beat stanford tcu is two and two now Georgia will miss undefeated. North Carolina with another dub. 28-19 over NC State rivals. Let's go. Oregon 4-0. They'll be in the rankings soon enough. Yoshi Dude, what's going on, brother? Huge win for Kansas. Yes, sir. And we're about to get another one against Missouri. Our arch nemesis, our bitter rivals. Also, since these games are being uh, posted individually on the other channel, I'm going to do a nice little intro for this game. So, you know, it's going to be like I'm restarting the stream. So here we go. Welcome back. We're going to be taking out Missouri next, folks. Strap your seat belts in. Get your popcorn ready. It's going to be a fun one. Let's take a look at the top 25. Florida State sends number three Oklahoma home with a shocking 27-17 defeat. All right, Texas is number one. Uh, Miami, Bama, Nebraska, USC, Ohio State, Iowa, Wisconsin, Boise State. Oklahoma drops to 10. 
Pittsburgh at 11, Georgia at 12. Uh, they take the spot of Georgia Tech, who we just defeated. Ole Miss at 13. We jump all the way up to 14th. This is our highest ranking in the series so far. Let's go, baby. Love to see that. North Carolina right behind us at 15. It'd be cool to see uh, Mississippi State in here as well. That'd be really cool. See all of our dynasty teams up in the top 25. Uh, West Virginia, they lost to LSU. They got absolutely just, wow. I don't even know what to say. They they were crushed. Just demoralized. Penn State at 20, Missouri at 21. So we'll be 14th ranked, um, taking on ranked 21 Missouri in this week's matchup. And they struggled with Western Illinois. 24-9 win for them. Okay. But they are 4-0, so that's all that matters. Undefeated going into our rivalry matchup. I like it. Uh, TCU won uh, pretty handedly against BYU and actually dropped two spots. Bizarre, but okay. Heisman watch. Let's take a gander. Anthony Westerman from Nebraska. Okay, you insist. I mean, he's having a good year. 15 total touchdowns, six touchdowns for Kenny Hickson. Receiver for Wisconsin, Jalen Hurts. Ten touchdowns for him. Uh, Ryan Brown receiver, seven total touchdowns for the Hokies. Kellen Moore, eight touchdown passes for Boise State at four versus Tulsa. Do, 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 do. Conference standings. Uh, let's see. We have not played a conference game from what I remember. This is our first conference game of the season. And nobody's played a conference game except for Oklahoma State and Baylor, which I believe they played last week. Oklahoma State defeated them 49-14. So RG3 and the boys struggling. I mean, their offense is looking good, but defense, uh, trash. Well, let's see. We finished third in the Big 12 North uh, last season. I'm hoping to get top two this time. I don't know if we'll win it. You know, we got to go through Nebraska. Colorado's having a good season so far. They're two and one. Missouri four and zero. Iowa State's doing well. Uh, we also have to uh, try to defeat Kansas State, which we did not do last season. Big Twelve currently the best conference in the land. Let's go. Thirty and seven record. Love to see that. All right, let's take a look at our recruiting real quick, and then we will jump into our game against Mizzou. Any movement here? No movement. But we are number one for Terrence Foster, the tight end. I would love to get him. 4 5 40 tight end. Uh, a plus hands. Really good player. Uh, I think we're number one on everybody except for one or two. All right, we got an official visit for Carl James, the free safety. And he's going to visit today, right now. Because we're going to beat up Missouri. All right? It's just going to happen. It ain't no guess. All right, so we're number one for everybody except for Justin Taylor. Technically, we're tied for number one, but Ohio State has the slight edge over us for the tackle. Anybody else want to come visit? No? Anybody? All right, bet. All right, so we got one visit coming. Let's make sure our stuff is turned on for the uh, pregame festivities. We'll save this. And we will jump into the next game, fellas. This is going to be the last game of the night. Uh, normally, for the weekday streams, I want to do three games for those streams. Uh, but unfortunately, I got home late from work. I had to stop at the store after work. So uh, it took me a little bit longer to get home than I wanted to. Had a late start to the stream. But that is the goal, though. Three, At least three games. Uh, Wednesdays, Thursdays, and Fridays. Do, do, do. Hopefully everybody is enjoying this stream so far. If you haven't already, slap that like button, guys. Subscribe if you're new. Join the Discord community. There is a link in the description below. Follow me on Twitter. Not that I post on there, but you can. There's a link for that as well. Also, for the EFL, the Elite Football League, we have merchandise in the description. I uh, can't remember what website it is. Teespring, I believe. You want to buy a mug or a shirt or, I think, a hoodie? 
You can go ahead and do that. The EFL will come back on the channel. All right. Here we go. Number 21, Missouri, traveling to Lawrence, Kansas for the Border Showdown. Number 14, Jayhawks. Number 21, Tigers. Now. And Houston is still undefeated. Uh, they lost their bowl game last year. I wonder if they'll go undefeated this regular season as well and get crushed in the bowl season. And we have another suspension here. What's going on here, Hall Miller? What are you doing, my guy? Team rules. Hall Miller was involved in a recent fraud scandal. Son, you have played three games and you're already going to jail. Bruh. Alright, we're going to give him, uh, jeez Louise. We'll give him three games. That is tough, guys. Already three suspensions. Um, so we're going to be without three players. Technically no starters. Uh, I mean, Hall Miller is in the nickel spot, but uh, we didn't run the nickel at all against Georgia Tech, so. Alright, we're going to wear our red for this one. Let's get it. Iowa beat Wisconsin game of the week. Nice. I like that. Look at that. Suspensions, injuries. I mean, it's it's a miracle both of us are undefeated on the season so far. Five receiving touch. Oh, my goodness. Blaine Gabbard has 18 touchdown passes on the year. Oh, boy. This should be fun. <laughs> Hopefully, they have a better performance than last season because we routed them. It wasn't even fair. But we are without a couple uh, 80 overall defenders, which is unfortunate. All right, Brad, take it away. Hi, everybody. This is Brad Nestler. With me, as always, Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. A mild, clear day is what we'll have for the Missouri Tigers and the Kansas Jayhawks. Beautiful weather. Rock Chalk J Hulk! Alright, we are favored, boys. Let's not disappoint. Also, I'm going to uh, turn the commentators off before the kickoff this time. Alright, let's see. Uh, pretty much no win in the game so far, and we are kicking off. So, let's get it. Boom. None. Freshman punter Harrison on for the kickoff. And from Lawrence, Kansas, we are underway. Let's go. The border showdown. Number 21 versus number 14. Uh-oh. Good return for Oliver. Tigers near midfield to start the game, and the extremely talented passing attack. Uh, it's going to be tough to slow them down here today, I think, but we're going to give it our all. 111 decibels. Let's go. New record. We just keep on improving. All right. Three-yard pickup for George over the middle. Gabbert is averaging four and a half touchdown passes a game. Oh my goodness. Yo, what up, Brandon? What up, brother? Play action. And another catch for George. He's going to be about a yard short of the six. Third and one coming up. And we're going to keep on blitzing. Keep on keeping on, baby. Come on, 
Third down and one. And they're going to get the first down. That's Oliver, the man that returned the opening kickoff up towards the 50. And he moves the chains for him. Yeah, I definitely expect a better showing this time around. Uh, last season, uh, we just started off hot, had the momentum the entire game, and they couldn't do anything. And that was a really bad drop from a wide-open target for Gabbert. I get short zone here. Let's go! Lavelle Luke, baby! 90-plus overall freshman linebacker. I believe that's his second pick of the season. Let's go. He jumped that so well. He also got crushed by, I believe that was the running back. <laughs> All right, let's go, though. We got the momentum. Let's see if we can get our ground game working because uh, we could not against Georgia Tech. There you go. Good block. Good block. Good juke. And we're still going. Tyler Hunt picking up eight or nine yards. Let's go. He's already got more yards rushing in this game than he did last game against the Yellow Jackets. That game was so tough. It was a lot of fun, though. Right, oh, got him to jump a little bit there. Pick up the middle. That's a first down. I'll take that. Really good game against Georgia Tech. Uh, through the air for Kale Pick. Our offense is in the top 100. I'll take it. And Hunt will pick up maybe four yards up the middle on the ice cell. And it's second down and six. Let's go halfback slam. Okay. All right. I'm not sure we got the first down there. No, we did not. Third down and one coming up. Another good run, though. And we're going to go wishbone, triple option. I know we got one somewhere, right? All right, let's get it. And that's the first down for the fullback. And he gets laid out by the linebacker. Amazing the, you know, the difference between Georgia Tech's front seven and Missouri's. Like, you can just instantly see that we're having more success running the football against these guys. But Georgia Tech, I mean, they were just all over us. They were in the backfield nearly every play. Let's go, Tyler. Oh, what a juke. Tyler Hunt inside the red zone. Let's go. Great run. He's up to 42 yards on the drive. All right, we're at the 17-yard line now. Let's try to get the ball to Rel Lewis. He's got fresh legs. He's the number two halfback. You better pick that up. Oh, my goodness. You know, if he caught the original pitch, he probably could have got some pretty good yardage out of that. That is unfortunate. It's... All right, let's try power option left. Get that block. Oh, my goodness. What a tackle by the corner. Beautiful play. Third down and nine coming up now.
Two minutes left in the first quarter. He's open. Oh my goodness, he underthrew him so bad. And that's our third missed opportunity in the red zone this season. Dang it. Man, I, I told him to uh, lead him to the back corner. And, well, it, he didn't. <laughs> Man. Looks like it's going to be another one of those kind of games, fellas. There we go. Keep getting pressure. And that was holding Tharp. Second tackle of the game. First sack. He missed the uh, second, third, and fourth quarter of last game with an injury. But it's second down and 25 now from inside their own five-yard line for Missouri. And decibel up to 114 in the stadium. That is a beautiful thing. Let's go, boys. Get him. I want a safety. We're not going to get it. That's a good run. Oh, my goodness. He dang near got the first down. What a run. Third and inches. Good grief. He's got some, uh, got some over-pursuing DBs on that play. Third and inches. So much for the safety, huh? Oh, my goodness. Went for the deflection, but Davis put up his left arm instead of his right, and Oliver is injured for the Tigers. That is their return man, their number one receiver. That would be a significant loss for Missouri. Mizzou with all the momentum right now after the interception in the end zone. Oh my goodness. Should have been picked, should have been caught. <laughs> Tharp with a nice hit. To draw the ball loose at the end there. Alright, second down and ten. Nice play. He might go. Oh my goodness, his momentum carried him out of bounds. George having a good game. I think that's his third reception already. For about 30 yards. And a fresh set of downs for Mizzou. And Blaine Gabbert's going to take off. Get him! You don't see that every day. Let's go man coverage. Blitz the outside linebackers. Marcus Oliver sprained elbow out for the game. Uh, so that's a pretty big loss for the offense, at least for today. Oh, good run. Linebacker ran right by him. That'll end the first quarter. All tied up at zero apiece. The defenses are really shining this season. Oh my goodness, I didn't even see him over there. What a play. George is in for the touchdown. Mizzou takes the lead. Perfectly designed pass play. And USC beats Arizona State 20-19. to What a game. Man, what a block right there as well by the slot receiver. That was nasty. And they got taunting. See if we can't block it. There we go. Stadium pulse on an extra point. Love to see it. And we dang near blocked it. But it is 7-0. Now, 
let's hold on to the football. Let's get a nice drive going again and maybe possibly not throw an interception in the end zone. Wow, what a kick. Jeez Louise. Through Zilly with no shot at returning that one. All right, let's go power T, normal, lead option to the left. Got Rel Lewis back there. He will be the halfback on the play, and we cannot pitch it. The left tackle uh, just couldn't hold his block to save his life. Second down and 12. Might have to try to throw the football a little bit. Uh, you know, not forcing interceptions, though. Don't want that. How is that not passing? Oh my goodness, no way he caught that. Trent Smiley, the sophomore. What fantastic concentration. Oh, that was beautiful. Let's go. I'll take it. Sometimes it's better to be lucky than good, you know? Do, 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 do. Come on, pick. Nice run. Let's go. That's a first down. Do, 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 do. I want to keep giving the ball to Hunt. He's having a good game so far. Oh, man. Three defenders just coming through the hole, and there's just no blocking. Unfortunate. Let's go wishbone. Power option. Haven't broke a big run today yet. I'm going to switch this to the left. Okay, we got the pitch. Tyler Hunt down the left sideline, and he might go inside the 20. This is a touchdown for Kansas. Let's go. I spoke too soon when I said we haven't broke a big run yet. Ask and you shall receive. Let's go. About to tie this bad boy up. That was a 50-yard touchdown run for the sophomore running back, Tyler Hunt. And that's going to put him pretty close to 100 yards, if not already there. Extra point is up and good. And we're all tied up. Seven all. Yeah, that definitely put him over 100 yards. Alright, Edwards, let's make a nice tackle here. Or not. It's alright, he's young. I expect him to miss some tackles. It's nice to see some offense on the field, though. That was a dangerous throw. Really risky. Two defenders in the area. Garrett having a good game, though. Having a really good season. He's got 19 touchdown passes now. Screen! And he's wide open. Really good run after the catch by Archie. That, that play was all because of Blaine Gabbert. I mean, he made the defender look so silly on the sack attempt. Oh my goodness, he definitely heard footsteps there. 
We had the strong safety Lee coming across the middle. And he did not want any of that smoke. All right, man coverage left side. Get that. Oh, my goodness. Good play, but you got to come away with that pick. That was Edwards, the freshman linebacker, the second of the two freshman middle linebackers. So far, he's got a missed tackle on a kickoff, and... Oh, there we go. Oh, my goodness. What was the safety doing? Oh, he just stood there. Look at this, 23. He just stopped moving. Oh, oh it's sickening. He should have had a pick. That's two times now we should have been able to make a play there, but unfortunate. Oh, he drops the touchdown. Wow, Lee misplayed that, and Manning drops it. Gabbard is out here just dropping dimes. Receivers aren't helping him out sometimes, though. Especially on that play. Second down and 10. From the Kansas 32-yard line. And we get the sack. What a hit. Let's get a replay of that, please. Blaine Gabbert injures his hip after the big hit. Hopefully he's all right. You never want to see a star player, especially for a rival, go down like that. And I don't think we get an injury uh, review here. Let's take a look. Who was it? Okay. Lock on to him. There, there you go. My goodness. And that was Johnson. He's having a great season. Look at this hit. Boom! Oof. We're only going to watch it once, though. I mean, he did just break the man's hip. All right. We're going to see the backup quarterback come in now for Mizzou. Not sure who it is. It's Kane. And, oh my goodness, he throws a dime as well, but the receiver is just pancaked. Drops it, and they're going to try a really long field goal here. I'm not sure about this one. Uh, we're just going to go field goal safe, man. This is a 55-yard try. I know their kicker does have a pretty good leg, but it's 55 yards. It's a long kick. Pick is up, and he's got it. Wow, he could make that from 60-plus. Officially a 56-yarder. He might be able to make a 65-yarder with that leg. Good grief. Who are you? And why can you not be on my team? All right, we got 247 left in the first half. Plenty of time to do something. Get down the field, make a nice drive, and get some points on the, on the board again. I, this this dude, he's got a bionic leg. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what else to say. Hammer jammer! What's going on, brother? He's got an NFL leg? Yeah, he does. It's ridiculous. I didn't realize that Justin Tuck played for Missouri. Pretty sure he played for Texas, but okay. Insane. Why can't we run to the right side of the field right now? I don't get that at all. How did work go? It was uh, pretty good. You know what I did for the last hour and 45 minutes? I literally just sat in my, my, uh, my chair at my desk. That's all I did. Wow. <laughs> wow. All right, we are no longer going to try to run the football to the right side of the field, guys. The right side of our offensive line is, it's like Swiss cheese out here. What in tarnation just happened? Also, Hammer, I did like a intro to this game. So when you're cutting it up for the second channel, just like listen for it. I'm going to try to do that before each game. 
that way there's an intro for every video and you don't have to do anything else with it sitting for hourly pay best yeah that's the best pay for sure hey decibels got up to 116 let's go new record get him keep the pressure on him boys that's Johnson he's got eight sacks oh my goodness the switch to the 3-4 has been a godsend for us. Oh, my word. Oh, you heard the intro? Okay. Bet. Yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to do that for every game, if I remember. Playing Gabbard out for the game with a hit pointer injury. All right, well. Oh, we got up to 117 decibels. Let's go. Keep on climbing, baby. All right, third down and 13 for the backup quarterback and the Mizzou Tigers. Complete opposites for the offenses in this game. All right, D, let's go. Nice, another drop pass because the safety gets there just in the nick of time. Manning drops his second touchdown of the game. 3 4 is so good, except an APF. Yeah, it makes no sense. I mean, the fact that we got so many, like, I don't, this kicker's going to make this. It's going to be easy for him. Um, the fact that we got so many linebackers in recruiting was the reason why we made the switch. And it's just, it's been a huge game changer for us. Yeah, I personally, I love the 3-4. You know, when I think 3-4, I always think of, like, the Steelers. You know, Joey Harrington, James, um, James, not Joey Harrington. What's his name? Oh, my goodness. Help me out, Hammer. Joey Porter. There we go. My goodness gracious. Uh, Joey Porter, blitzing all the time. And uh, James Harrison, those guys were so nasty, blitzing. Uh, but, yeah, that's, that's what I think about with the 3-4. They were always just so good at it. Joey Harrington. Oh, my goodness. All right, here we go. Here we go. Tyler Hunt down the left sideline. He might go again. Run, Tyler. Oh, sit down, son. He's so strong. All right, we are just going to abuse the left side of this defense with our ground attack. We can't run to the right. We have, like, a quadriplegic playing right tackle, apparently. I don't know what's going on with him. But he, he literally can't stop a cold. Uh, he can't stop it at all. So, left side it is. Oh, man, we couldn't pitch it that time. All right, let's see. What do we got? Second down and 12. Man, oh man. I'm going to try to throw it up to McDougal over on the left side. Nope. Got a few yards up the middle. Take that. Third down and nine coming up. Been having a rough time this season running the football with pick. Uh, even though he had so much success last season, well, in the last, in the second half of last season. I guess teams have figured him out a little bit. And I died. Couldn't throw it, and Pick is injured. Nope, he's getting up. Tried to throw that up to Tyler Hunt, but he just didn't throw it. All right, we're at the 43. You know what? Heck with it. Let's go for it. Need nine yards. We're going to keep it on the ground, see what happens. That's a first down. Let's go. No way. Oh, it's offsides. Okay. I thought there was holding. And we are still 100% on fourth down tries for the year. Beautiful. Right. 
All right, here we go. Safety's cheating over to the middle. McDougal! Oh, he dropped it! Oh, this should have been a touchdown. Come on, baby. That's one on one coverage there. You gotta make that play. This is unacceptable. Alright, what are we doing here? Let's see. A little slant. Alright, keep going, keep going, keep going. And why can he not throw the football when I'm pressing the button? Please, EA, help me. Alright, third down at 10. We're not in field goal range. Alright, I'm gonna go McDougal deep shot left side again. See what happens with the safety. Oh my goodness. Oh, I'm taking off. I hesitated, but we're still going to get it. Let's go. Beautiful play. If I didn't hesitate, I probably could have got like five or six more yards, to be honest. But I thought that uh, the uh, defensive end was going to be able to get there quicker. But, you know, our offensive line actually blocked him on the play, which is really surprising to me. I might go to McGriff through the seam here. Let's see what we got going on. Oh my goodness. Yep, I just got rid of that one. That was, whew, that was almost a complete disaster of a play. Alright, let's go power team normal. Try to catch him off guard with this play. We got two timeouts left. It's second down. Up to the end zone, and dropped interception. All right. Well, 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 well. That did not catch them off guard, unfortunately. Hmm. What to do, what to do. Let's go with this one. 13 seconds left. Ah, dang it. Good tackle. It's alright, we'll kick a field goal. I tried to catch him off guard with an RPL. A little run pass option, but... That linebacker was right there. Alright, field goal time. This will get us within a field goal. Francis, he's got it, and it's 13 to 10 as we head into the locker rooms for halftime in the Border Showdown. Can we get the dub over the 21st ranked 4-0 Missouri Tigers? We are looking for our fourth win of the season as well. And we get the ball to start as we did kick off to start the game. Let's go, boys. My goodness. I mean, who is this guy? This kicker is insane. Alright, O-line. Please block for me. Here we go. Oh, nice tackle. He got in there pretty quickly. Alright, I'm chancing it. We're going to run to the right, guys. And unfortunately, linebacker came through unblocked. Still got three yards, though. Third down and four. Definitely doable here. We do not have an option out of this formation. What, what am I doing? Alright, third down and four. Let's get it. Got the guy to jump again. Oh, this could be really good. 
First down, Kale Pick up to the 44-yard line. We got their defensive tackle to jump, and it was glorious. Let's see if we can run to the right out of the shotgun formation. Maybe. I might hand this off to Tyler Hunt, though. Yep. I thought that that linebacker was going to be there, so I spun, but it did not work. Feels real bad. I'm stubborn, so I'm just going to keep trying to run to the right. I got to. Oh, here we go. Pick. Let's go, Rel Lewis. Down the right sideline. Rel Lewis is gone. Touchdown, KU. Let's go, baby. That's what I'm talking about. That'll give us the lead in the third quarter. Here in the border showdown in Lawrence, Kansas. Fifty-seven yard touchdown run. And this has been one heck of a game, boys. Extra point is up and good. Seventeen to thirteen. See what the Mizzou offense can do. Their backup quarterback is in the game. Gabbard out for the rest of today with the hit pointer injury. Say insanity is doing the same thing over and over and expecting a different result. Hey, we did get a different result. What a hit. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Sent it before that run. Let the record show. All right. I'll let the record show. But you were wrong. All right. Decibels up to 117 again. Let's go. Oh my goodness. Let's go. That was Johnson again. His third sack. Ninth on the year. In just the fourth game of the season. He is on a historic run right now. Oof. And if I'm not mistaken, we do have a linebacker visiting the campus today, watching this game happen. Uh, he, he's just got to be salivating right now, just watching this linebacking core uh, just performing so well. Get him! Good run by Kane. We have uh, 280 more rushing yards today than we did uh, against Georgia Tech. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go, go, go. Nice, another hit. Was that Johnson again? It was. Oh, my goodness. He is just getting through. Almost every time I send him on a blitz, he is getting through and hitting the quarterback, or at least hurrying him. Second down and ten. I mean, they might even, they might be in field goal range right here, guys. Let's be honest. They got a robot for a kicker. And another drop pass for the receiving core. All right, third down and ten. And another sack. Oh, who got him this time? That's a defensive end this time. I can't see that. I think that's the other Johnson. No, that was Marshall with the sack. Let's go. I love that we're getting a lot of pressure on quarterbacks now this season. We struggled a little bit. We only had, I think, one guy last season that did really well. And everybody else just, I mean, it was non-existent. Let's go, Sims. Up to the 30-yard line. And Rel Lewis is on fire after his 57-yard touchdown run last drive. 
can hand it off to him up the middle, see what happens here. And only gets a yard or two. Let's try the right side again. Uh, this one might not actually work, to be honest. We're going to switch to the left and toss it out to Rel Lewis. Let's go, Rel. And nice blocking. Oh, my goodness. Pushed out of bounds by his own teammate. And Lewis with 74 yards on the ground in this one. I'm going to try a play action. Send McDougal deep. We got him. McDougal! All the way inside the 15 yard line. Let's go! I will do it myself as the receivers, alright? I care not. I care not. Alright, what do we got here? Halfback option. So I, I kind of like this play. He hands it off to the halfback. And then we've got the other halfback going out with him. So it's kind of neat. And we got a false start. So we're not doing it. Awesome. Feels bad. I'm going to try another play action. Let's go, Smiley. Oh, man. Look at my right tackle. He's just standing there. That man is asleep at the wheel. Second down and 21 to go. All right, Lewis might be the go-to guy here. I'm scared. Oh my goodness. I think we lost a yard, but... It's alright, we didn't turn the ball over. We lost three yards on that. What? Alright, we're not in field goal range because we missed a 43-yarder last game. So we gotta get some of these yards back. And we don't. We lose more. Awesome. Great blocking, guys. What a fantastic end to the drive. And he wants to go for it. Might as well. So I'm not going to make that field goal. Might go seam to McGriff. If we can draw him off sides here and get a free play, that would be outstanding. So that's the goal. Come on. And did we get him? We did. Let's go. The hard count, baby. Now we're going to kick the field goal. 40 yarder. Oh my goodness. I can't believe that actually worked, guys. That was beautiful. Well executed, gentlemen. All right, Francis. I know you can make a 40 yarder, all right? Not a whole lot of wind, going a little to the right. And Francis gets that one up and through, let's go. See, he looked like he could have made that from 50. And yet we missed a 43 yarder last game against GT. I don't, I don't know what happened. All right, that makes it a one touchdown game, 20 to 13. Less than 30 seconds to go in the third quarter. Nice, let's go. Nestin with a nice tackle. You know, this is a, a really good game. I'm enjoying it. Both games today have been pretty good. A lot of good defense. Got some fireworks in this one, finally. Let's 
go D. Oh, he's taking off. And a big tackle by Davis. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Second down and inches. Probably the final play of the third quarter. Just 10 seconds left. Play action. Wide open, and it's picked off. And it's Johnson. He's got three sacks and a pick in this game. Let's go. What a performance from the outside linebacker. Man, he read that perfectly. He can do it all, man. He can blitz. He can sack the quarterback. He can pick him off. Man, what a day he's having. And that'll end the third quarter. Get your fours up in the chat if you're still here. We're up 20-13 to 13 here in the border showdown against our bitter rivals, the Missouri Tigers, here in Lawrence, Kansas. Let's go. Okay, run Tyler. And can't stiff arm him. Still a decent run, maybe five or six yards off the right. All right, second down and four. We're at the 28 yard line, and we're throwing it. Um, he's wide open. Oh, no way! I got hit as soon as I snapped the ball. What just happened? What in tarnation? Zachary Joseph, what's going on, baby? How did I get hit so quickly, guys? Look at this. Look at how insane this is. Snapped the ball, and I died. I mean, he's just he's dead on the ground. Look at how fast he's in there. I was trying to throw it to Tyler Hunt, who was just wide open over there. They left him unguarded. That is insane. What a play from Dixon. My goodness. That was crazy. Best play of the game so far, in my opinion. That's a game changer. Gets his team the ball right back. Stops us from scoring. We were in prime position to extend the lead. Oh, man, I was all over that play. Do I have the Bengals O-line? Um, I have the Kansas Jayhawk O-line. Which I do not think is better than the Bengals. So yeah, uh, basically. Oh no! Oh, tie ball game! <laughs> oh man! That's unfortunate, fellas. got ourselves a ball game let's block this let's go imagine we block it win by one that play action got me so bad I can't even lie and the extra point is up and good 20 all with five minutes left in the game I mean I definitely uh, I fell asleep on that that play on defense it'd be like that sometimes Where was the coverage at? It was my fault, Yoshi. I forgot how to football. Let's go, Terzilli. Let's go, baby. I'm surprised we were actually able to uh, return a kickoff. Beautiful. Came in at the most perfect time? Absolutely. They're the same picture? Absolutely, Hammer. <laughs> Oh, nice juke move, and Hunt somehow gets three yards out of that disaster of a play. Oh, he got four. Let's go. All right, I'm going to do something we don't normally do. Bear with me. Fullback dive. He got one or two yards. Let's go. 
All right, they're down to five. We're going to risk it and run to the right side of the field. We've had, I don't know, maybe one or two successful plays on the right side today. Oh, my goodness. How does he get on the right of my quarterback so I can't pitch it right there? What? What in tarnation? Uh, Missouri has just all the momentum. It's going to be an exciting finish. I love games like this. All right, Harrison, I need you to punt the ball more than 20 yards, my guy. I know you're a freshman, but... I, I mean, their kicker is kicking the ball 90 yards every time. So get good, please. I'm begging. Let's go defense. All right, I think we're going to switch to nickel here. Cover two. I want to see a 120 decibel. Let's go. 117 is the record so far here in Lawrence. Where are you going to go? Where are you going? Can I get a tackle? Oh, that's a face mask. Oh, man. That's tough. Well, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. We're going to go back to the 3-4. <laughs> get gooder. I'm trying, Hammer. I really am. I promise. Let's go. Oh, my goodness. Is he okay? Somebody call an ambulance. Brah. That was, oh my goodness, that was Johnson again. His fourth sack of the day. Second down and 18 coming up now. Wow. He's got 10 sacks this year. This is the game. This is game number four. Wow, there's no way they got caught that. I can't cover that. That was just a crazy reception. All right, they're down at five. I'm going to go with quarterback spies. They have run the quarterbacks a couple times in the game. And that, no way that's a catch. He's on the bench. We're challenging, boys. Right? There's no way he caught this, right? Like, there ain't no way. That's a terrible camera angle. No, that's a good camera angle. He is way out of bounds. That dude is... He's sitting on the bench drinking a Gatorade. Like, how do you call that a catch, ref? Let's go! Good challenge. Hold him to a field goal. Uh, we're going to go just safe return. I don't want anything crazy happening here. He's, how is he missed on the year? He's 6 of 7. This is a 49-yard try. Should be should be easy for him. I, wow, don't do that. Do not press triangle. Oof. That was tough. They're wasting all the time. I don't know how because they had an incomplete pass on the last play. Field goes up, and it is obviously good. Missouri takes the lead late in the game. we got plenty of time, though. 227 left. We're down three. Got to have a good drive. All right, Sims, we're doing it. From eight yards deep. Oh, I tried to spin left. Didn't work. All right, we got 223 left. <laughs> EA gonna EA. Yeah, I, I didn't know that hammer. I'm sorry. Oh, nice block by Kale Pick. And he springs Rel Lewis free. And he is off to the races. Over 100 yards in the end zone. 
taking the lead back for the Jayhawks with an 84-yard touchdown run. Let's go. Oh, that was pretty. The quarterback out here throwing game-changing blocks. That was ridiculous. Yeah, we like to run the football here at the University of Kansas. It's up and good, and we're up 27-23 now. That took no time off the clock whatsoever. Two twelve left in the ball game. All right, let's get it. Come on, Edwards. I'm I'm getting blocked. Just oh my goodness. Thankfully, uh, we got a nice tackle at the other end of the field. All right, two oh nine left. They got to go 78 yards for the win. Can the defense hold strong? Or will we crumble? And we get the sack. Oh my goodness, Holden Tharp gets in there on the action. Let's go. Lost a seven on the play. And I'm pretty sure Holden Tharp was just doing the crip walk. I, I don't know what's going on here. We got Snoop Dogg on the field. <laughs> All right, second out of 17. Less than two left in the game. And that is caught by Hayden. Eight-yard pickup, Tharp on the tackle. I'm going to send um, uh, Holden Tharp on a blitz again. See if we can get some more pressure on the quarterback. Third and nine. Big, big play. And it's picked off by Davis, the user interception. Will it seal the game for us? We have seven sacks, seven hurries, and three INTs. I am loving the defense. What a game this has been. What's with the different fonts on the graphics? I, I could not answer that question for you, sir. I, I just do not know. And pick. Pitches it out. Tyler Hunt. He might go. Tyler Hunt is gone. And we extend the lead just like that with a 34-yard touchdown run. Let's go. Making Kansas great again? Yes, sir. Man, what a phenomenal game this has been. Definitely a better matchup this season than it was in Season 1, where we just cruised to an easy win. Obviously, there's still time for Missouri in this game. But the way things are trending right now, we've got all the momentum, and we're up by 11. With 134 remaining. Hunt is a man amongst boys, absolutely. We're going to try to get him on the Heisman watch list this season. I don't know if he's going to be able to get there, uh, especially with <laughs> how we performed against Georgia Tech on the ground, but it'd be nice to get him on there. Oh, I got crushed. Get up, Edwards. Let's go. All right, 131 left. Tigers have all three timeouts left still. Oh my goodness, oh, what is he doing? That should have been another pick. I switched to him and he's like turning around, running back towards the line of scrimmage for some reason. Hunt, play the game for Kansas. There's no way they're not going to give player of the game to Johnson. The man had, has four sacks, 
Oh, I thought he caught that. What a play by Lubbock Smith. But yeah, Johnson had four sacks and a pick in this game. How does he not get player of the game? I understand, you know, almost 200 rushing yards is phenomenal, but... I don't think we win this game without Johnson crushing the quarterback every other play. They're down to 10 for Mizzou. And I should have had another user, but we do get the stop. It's 4th and 10. Obviously, they're going to go for it here. They do not have a choice. Yeah, let's go special teams. That, that makes sense. Alright, this will essentially end the game if we get the stop. Does Mizzou have any life left in them? And they do. Hayden, what an out route that was. I, I got cooked. That is such a hard route to defend. Going to send Holden Tharp on a blitz from the left side, the star linebacker. And they're going to review the catch. I think he actually was in bounds for that, though. I, it looked like he got both feet in. No, just one. Well, that's a catch. I don't know why we're booing, guys. That was 100% a catch. Here we go. First and 10 for Missouri. Trying to keep their undefeated season alive. They need a couple scores, though. I'm covering two guys. Oh, my goodness. And there's Johnson with another tackle, I think. No, that was uh, Lavelle Luke, the freshman, on the stop. No, actually, uh, yeah, it was. I know what I'm talking about sometimes. And George with another catch. Under a minute to go now. And DJ Marshall, who had a sack earlier in the contest, is injured on the play. Uh, that looks like a head injury. Hopefully he's okay. Uh, hopefully just a migraine, if anything. All right, they're down at five. And, oh my goodness, I do not know how we didn't get the deflection, but first down, Missouri, and they call their second timeout. Mizzou not done yet. I'm still fighting. But that play is not going to help too much. Only you got two yards. And they're going to go no huddle. Really don't have a choice at this point. And Sapp gets another catch. Nice broken tackle. But the clock is running. And the backup quarterback, Blake Kane, has injured his knee on the play. So they're going to bring in their third string quarterback. Let's see who it's going to be. Quarterback's dropping like flies in this game. And it's number one. I, I'm not sure what the name is. It is Lawson. And he almost throws a pick on his first attempt. And that'll bring up fourth down and two. That's the ninth hurry for the Jayhawk defense. Both teams one for one on fourth down tries in the game. Man, he's wide open. Johnson with another tackle. Just 15 seconds left. Missouri with one timeout left. They need a... I mean, I would kick a field goal right here, honestly. Your kicker's got a bionic leg. Kane back in the game. And, I mean, they're out of time now. That's going to do it. Final play of the ball game. I expect, uh, you know, just a throw to the end zone, I guess. And they're just going to run it. 
And Kane doesn't even get the first down, and that will do it. Oh no, Taylor Lee injures his shoulder on the final play of the contest. No, that is our starting strong safety. That better not be serious, but that is the final score, 34-23. We pulled away a little bit at the end there. Uh, got the running game going quite well against Missouri. Not so much against Georgia Tech, but a good rebound game for us on the ground. And we win the marching drum in the border, what was it, border showdown against Mizzou. We are 4-0 on the season now. It's another win against the top 25 opponent, our third of the year, I believe. Yeah, we beat TCU, we beat Georgia Tech, and now Missouri. Those are all three ranked squads. So we're having a great year. We beat Buffalo in, week, uh, in our first game as well. 378 yards on the ground. We were 3 for 9 passing. We got sacked twice. We sacked them seven times. I'm pretty sure that's a record for us in the series. Uh, each team had three turnovers. We picked them off three times. We fumbled, or we lost uh, two fumbles, and we threw one pick. All right, 190 yards rushing for Tyler Hunt, two touchdowns. Rel Lewis, best game of his career, uh, the senior, with five carries, 158 yards, 31.6 yards per rush. Two touchdowns, long of 84, and pick with uh, three fumbles. Feels real bad. A couple drops for the receiving core. What the heck? They have Kale Pick with a drop? Uh, what? What do you mean? Holden Tharp, six tackles. We had a lot of guys with four tackles. Tackles for loss. Steven Johnson, uh, four sacks, four tackles for loss, a pick. It's crazy to me that he did not get player of the game. I, mean, I understand that Tyler Hunt had a phenomenal game running the football, but I, I there's no way I wouldn't give it to Johnson. There's just no way. Francis, two for two field goals. And nothing really great on returns in this one. And that'll do it for this game. Let's simulate the rest of the week. Uh, make sure our recruiting is in order. And we'll save it and get on out of here for the day. NC A&T State just beat Ohio. I love it. Miami just hung up 60 plus points on, I believe that was Boston College. Nebraska still undefeated. Florida State undefeated. Duke, trash. Do, 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 do. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying this series so far. Now that we have uh, good sliders, you know, we can have games like this one and the game against Georgia Tech all the time. Uh, I'm enjoying it a lot more this season for sure. The first season was a bit of a struggle to get the sliders in the correct, correct way. But I think we found a good slider set now. And tomorrow night we're going to be taking on Kansas State in Manhattan, Kansas. In the Sunflower Showdown, we got to get revenge from last season where we just, I mean, we stunk up the joint in that game. We couldn't get anything going. And then we'll take on Baylor in Lawrence, Kansas, uh, trying to get revenge on them as well. And if all goes well, if I get home on the correct time, we will also play against Colorado in Boulder. So that should be a fun one. Take a quick look at everything real quick and then get out of here. Michigan State. Beats Ohio State. Let's go, baby. That's what I'm talking about. House broken. Get wrecked. No marathon streaming tonight? No, sir. I need to eat actual food instead of ramen. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go eat some real food. It's gonna be nice. Top 25 polls. Alabama actually jumps Miami after Miami put up 65 on BC. I mean, I guess Bama's win over Florida was pretty good, but. See what else we got here. We are up to number 12. That is a new high for us in the series. Beautiful. North Carolina still right there behind us at 13. Love to see that. They just beat Virginia Tech 38-33. Really good game there. Ohio State is 2-2. Two two. Get them out of here. 
All right, we need Mississippi State in the rankings now. Navy and Oregon jump up into the rankings, and Missouri's still ranked. Uh, obviously, they deserve to be ranked. They're, they've only got one loss on the season now. Uh, Michigan State does not get in the rankings after beating Ohio State. Uh, Texas A&M and Tech are getting votes. Clemson, Arkansas, Stanford, Maryland, and Northwestern. Okay. I like that. All right, that is the top 25. Christian Schrock. What's the sliders? I will look at them in one moment, good sir. Let's take a look at the Heisman watch. Kellen Moore falls off of there. Uh, we got a receiver from North Carolina. Let's go. Six touchdown catches for him. He's having a great season. No surprise, there's a Houston receiver, uh, Aaron Rowe. Nine total touchdowns, almost 1,000 all-purpose yards. That guy's going crazy. Uh, players of the week. Okay, so it shows Johnson. Johnson earns player of the week after Kansas' Big 12 opening victory. The main man. I mean, he was insane in that game. All right, let's go to the Big 12. Let's see Lamar Miller, let's go, Miami. Three touchdown rushes for him. Wow, so Johnson gets Defensive Player of the Week for the Big 12, but Hunt does not get Player of the Week for offense because Michael Summers throws for six touchdowns. Absurd. Conference standings. Uh, we are right there, neck and neck with Nebraska and Texas and Texas Tech and Oklahoma. But in our division, obviously just Nebraska. We got a good shot at it this season, boys. We just got to get through Nebraska. Strongest conferences. We were number one. We still are. Let's go. Love that. Take a look at the coach report card. And then I'll take a quick look at the, uh, the sliders. I went over the sliders a whole bunch uh, during season one. Um, let's see. When you win like this, the players are having a lot of fun out there. Keep it up. All right, so we're 4-2 and two against top 25 teams now. 2-1 and one versus rivals. And we're currently riding a seven-game winning streak dating back to last year, so I'm liking it. Win the Big 12 title. Wow, lofty goals here, guys. My goodness, playing a January bowl game. Well, we did that last season. Finished season in the top 25. I think we got a good shot at doing at least two of those. All right, let me see. Audio, put that back on for when we get back you know, tomorrow. All right, so we're on, we're on Heisman. Six-minute quarters, fatigue on, injuries on, uh, impact camera off, home field advantage on, camera shake off, return camera trash, get it out of here forever. I hate it. Uh, AI, here's the human. Um, that's the offense. So here's the defense. And special teams. All we have is kickoff length because we were having so many kick return touchdowns. And here is the computer offense. Again, this is on Heisman. Their stuff is all the way jacked up, and our defense is all the way down except for tackle. And here's their defense. You really want break block all the way down. Like, there's just no question about it. Uh, interceptions, even with zero, uh, I mean, you're still going to throw a bunch of picks if you throw bad passes. Uh, knockdowns, you can still see there's a lot of, there's plenty of knockdowns. Uh, their tackling is pretty good. I think the problem that the computer has right now against my running back is just the fact that on the option plays, I mean, they're just, we're just getting wide open. There's just open field in front of us, so that's why we're having success there. So it's not really missed tackling, honestly. But that is going to do it for this stream, guys. Uh, be sure to tune in tomorrow around 4 Eastern Standard Time. Uh, I will post in the Discord. If you're not in there, go ahead and join us in the Discord channel, in our community. There's a link in the description below. Uh, be sure to like this video, subscribe if you're new, and I hope to see each and every one of you uh, in the next stream, guys. That'll be tomorrow at 4. Until then, take it easy, guys.